Canola prices broke past the $1,000 per metric ton mark over the past week, and wheat prices are also continuing to surge. As Devine reports in this next story, you can expect the prices to remain strong for quite some time. Weather and supply chain shortages are combining to drive up prices for major agricultural exports around the world. And here in southern Alberta, it is no different. David Lee with Marketplace Commodities in Lethbridge says drought has been the big driver in prices. It was quite a severe drought, um, really affected canola especially. Um, Wheat quality were quite lucky as decent quality, but the yields were down quite substantially from previous years. So we have quite a low carryout from the previous year, and then going into this drought uh, this year uh, has yeah, definitely spurred on some, some of the highest prices that we've seen in, in years on these commodities. He adds that weather is not the only factor when it comes to why the prices are climbing and says not to hold your breath for the cost to drop anytime soon. We're definitely seeing increased congestion at the ports. Uh, we're seeing rains in Australia hampering their harvest. Uh, so at this time here, we're just anticipating them to remain fairly strong uh, for, the, for the foreseeable future. Uh, moisture across Western Canada has also been a little low this year, so we're a little unsure of how next year is going to turn out as well. Lee says that it is too early to determine how the flooding in BC will affect grain prices. He says that rail lines are working as hard as they can in an already congested container market. For Bridge City News, I'm Naveen Day.